I'm Mike Bowers. I'm Director of Photography for the Global Mail. I'm talking pictures this morning with syndicated cartoonist Paul Zanetti. A warm welcome back, mate. G'day, mate. Thanks for uh, inviting me down. Paul, at uh, COAG this week, the state premier showed a distinct inability to agree on anything to do with disability. Yeah, well, uh, it was a bit disappointing for something that was so vital. Tambourg's picked up on it. Can't you politicians put aside self-interest and think of the carers? I don't think you realise how difficult it is. It really does sum up. Sums well. it up perfectly. Probably the cartoon of the week. <laughs> It was almost like all the Premiers were playing off the play card, really, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, I like this photograph here with the Premiers just before they went in, and um, we've got the WA Premier here, and he's about to uh, demonstrate what they should do when they get in and, and approach Julia and get their hands nice this, and firmly around her This neck. is how we wring a bit more money out of the, <laughs> of the yes. federal government, you know? <laughs> um, You've drawn the NDIS as a pretty uh, sick patient here, Paul. Yeah, well, yeah, needs a bit of resurrecting. And uh, here I've got Campbell Newman, the Queensland Premier, and he's just about to switch off the life support system. Something like that is very difficult to satire because you don't want to be seen as uh, being insensitive. So you've really got to try and portray it as it is, and that was the pretty much uh, the, the, the vision that came to mind. You're not trying to tell the viewers that cartoonists have a heart, surely? Uh, yeah, <laughs> we, we, we try not to lean on it too often. <laughs> Look, the Olympics are upon us, and um, it seems the popularity of the Prime Minister Julia Gillard is is a Herculean Olympic task yes. that she's got before her. Not, not much uh, successful pole vaulting going on here, but this cartoon could possibly be a new Olympic event where we've got this kind of catapulting pole mechanism and uh, as you throw more poles on it it's going to sort of catapult her out the window but she know. seems seems pretty well super glued to her seat there doesn't she this week the prime minister julia gillard departed from being photographed with babies and was photographed with, uh, with film stars with Will, instead. wolverine wolverine yes yes I she, saw could, this. she yeah. could do with a set of these claws these already. blades yeah well i think she's uh She's been a bit of a victim of, of Wolverine herself here, and yep. I actually saw that she'd given twelve and a half million dollars to to the movie to um, to keep it here. I thought, gee, that's got to be the most um, expensive photo op in a while, hasn't it? <laughs> um, Mark, nice, son, beautiful. Uh, Mark's detail on these things is just enviable. It's enviable. enviable. The cartoonists sort of look at each other's work, and do, do you get? Do you I, get I'm very envy? envious. I get pencil envy when I look at Mark's stuff. I actually, I actually do. Gillard visits Wolverine set. Uh, Prime Minister, I'm sorry, did I do that? No, Mr. Mr. Jackman, don't worry, it was the opinion polls. I think the caucus room would probably leave her looking a bit like that as well. She could do with a set of those things in the caucus. Paul, it's a pity Tony Abbott wasn't in town because uh, Morgan Changarai is visiting from Zimbabwe and he, he's a man who knows about being in opposition. Well, he's, he's come here to uh, address us and, and, and tell us all about his new power sharing arrangements with, with Mugabe. I think you came to the wrong place, myself, <laughs> to see how power sharing works. And finally, Jackie O became Jackie Oh My God mm. when uh, as some sort of stunt where she was pashing. Mm. But he, I mean, that, that's a pash, isn't it? You oh, call that a pash. It's, it's disturbing, whatever it is. Jackie O commented that he had very soft lips, apparently. Oh. Well, I'll just take a word for it, mate. Um, <laughs> it's Sunday morning, people are having breakfast. Paul, it's always a great pleasure having you on. Thanks very much for yeah. taking the time. Thanks for having me down. I'll let you do the throw. Back to you, Barry.